relationship between equilibrium constant K, reaction quotient Q, and Gibbs energy G. We have an equation showing the relationship between the standard state free energy of reaction with the free energy of reaction at any moment in time during a reaction. Delta G is equal to delta standard G plus RT natural log Q. Delta G is equal to free energy at any moment. Delta standard G is equal to standard state free energy. R is equal to ideal gas constant is equal to 8.314 joules per K mole. T is equal to temperature Kelvin. Natural log Q is equal to natural log of the reaction quotient. When delta G is equal to zero, a reaction is at equilibrium. Q is equal to Kc. Let's consider the above reaction at equilibrium. Zero is equal to delta standard G plus RT natural log K. Delta standard G is equal to minus RT natural log K gives natural log K is equal to minus delta standard G upon RT. Taking anti-log of both sides, we get K is equal to E raised to the power minus delta standard G upon RT. Using the equation, the reaction spontaneity can be interpreted in terms of the value of delta standard G. As the magnitude of delta standard G changes, so does the equilibrium constant K. If delta standard G is less than zero, then minus delta standard G upon RT is positive and E raised to the power minus delta standard G upon RT greater than 1, making K greater than 1, which implies a spontaneous reaction. If delta standard G is greater than 0, then minus delta standard G upon RT is negative and E raised to the power minus delta standard G upon RT is less than 1, that is K is less than 1, which implies a non-spontaneous reaction.